the Eco Business Fund partnered with the International Climate Initiative, IKI, of Germany's Federal Ministry for the Environment, Nature Conservation, Nuclear Safety, and Consumer Protection, BMUV, and fund partner Banco Hipotecario to pilot a groundbreaking ecoacoustics project in El Salvador. Ecoacoustics is a tool to estimate a biodiversity index by recording the sounds of birds, insects, or amphibians using sound recorders placed in different landscapes. The pilot project in El Salvador aimed to assess how ecoacoustics could be applied in coffee agroforestry systems, particularly when analyzing biodiversity differences between coffee crops grown in the shade versus those that are not. We are here at Finca Malacara, which is located 1,600 meters above sea level. It is a geisha coffee farm where we are installing these devices called AudioMoth. These are small devices that record the sounds of birds, amphibians, and insects. The idea behind installing these devices in this kind of forest is to assess the impact of good agricultural practices on biodiversity within coffee plantations. We are installing several of these devices at different elevations and different coffee plantations with more and less shade. As an impact fund, one of the key tasks is to measure impact by collecting data indicating the fund's contribution to the positive impact on the environment, the conservation of biodiversity, and mitigation and adaptation to climate change. While we have already developed methodologies to measure some of these indicators, measuring biodiversity is one of the most difficult indicators given that conventional tools and technologies do not allow us to scale up the measurement of biodiversity across all investments. To carry out this ambitious project, we have joined forces with different institutions that provide a vast level of expertise. Natural resources have a value just like coffee, just like everything else. And it's a value we must preserve, improve, measure, and see how we can protect it. Today, the markets, and especially the newer generations, want to know more. They want to have more information about what they consume, where their product comes from, and what type of product they are consuming. So, I believe information on biodiversity would be very interesting for our buyers, who can also utilize it and tell a positive story of positive biodiversity impacts on farm level. And I am convinced that the market would be very interested in this project, and that this would be something positive for us all and for our consumers. Ecoacoustics has the potential to become a suitable and scalable monitoring method that will enable investors to assess the biodiversity impact of their projects accurately. The Eco Business Fund Development Facility is in discussion to advance this research. Continued studies utilizing ecoacoustics data could provide valuable insights for farmers and conservationists, facilitating sustainable agricultural practices and the preservation of biodiversity in coffee agroforestry systems. We cannot continue to expand nature. We must take care of it, and we must preserve it for future generations.